Oh, this guy's new, actually. Some sort of Asian Toad Man. Do you want to do Asian Toad Man? Yeah, you know what? We just watched Devil, or we just played Devil's Third, yeah. and uh, there was a character in it who I think I can take some inspiration from for sure. this one. Sure. Go ahead and breakfast at Timothy's <laughs> us, Rob. Okay. <laughs> How hard can I get canceled? Do you think if I get canceled, that'll turn our... Th- It'll just explode the show. Get a fucking spotlight in the New York Times. Popularity by like famous you famous YouTuber (laughs) Rob. Kotaku. Get a get our own Kotaku article, dude. Yeah, Kotaku, where they like question like they don't have a gay character on their uh, (laughs) let's stream channel. Like we should cancel them just for that. Uh, All right, hey, no, no, wait. What's uh, let's see. We gotta mix up your voice. Uh, your voice. What's a good? What's uh, what's a good style then? What's like a? Uh. Can you give me uh I don't know enough about this character yet. Yeah, I mean my ranges are all relative. Can you give deep, me like anime like, protagonist maybe? Anime protagonist. Would that be like Hey there, kid! That's not anime That's protagonist. absolutely not it. That is a uh hey. that is Steve Buscemi trying to convince everybody he's a teenager. Hey there, kid, you got a minute to learn what it means to fight like f- oh so Oh God! So he's like a Chinese martial artist. So that's what they're I'm going for Chinese he's, martial artist. Because he's wearing a Chinese shirt. Um. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, oh God! What's? I cannot think of a way okay, to do fine, this without it Okay, fine. I'll do it. Fuck this. Hey there, kid. You had a minute to learn what it means to fight. Like fight with your whole heart. Now he's Alex Jones. I mean, are you happy about that? Well, was, I, I can see you're bringing like with potential, fucking... kid, but there's a heap of stuff you don't know about a fight. Stylish moves, hit it big. There's a whole list. Feel free to hit me up. You got a question, hey, Brendo? Like Who am Irish. I? Someone, some call me the Battle Master, and I don't stop him, but I could with fighting. Huh? Anywho, I got a great life traveling, training. Some third thing. If you see me around, give me a holla. So he's just like an extra battles guy. That's fun. Alex Jones, it is. He sure is. Are you happy you made me do that? Well, was I, I'm there, just there's another do character. I, there's another like character I have that voice prepped for. Then you should have saved it for that guy. I want Rockhawk to be that voice. Fuck you, Rob. <laughs> so maybe fine. we can make Rock. <laughs> oh, we can make Rockhawk really Japanese for no reason. Yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> What's his name? <laughs> Rockhawk. <laughs> Can you say that again? Rock hawk. So just one big rock hawk. Yeah. That's what I heard. You can't speak underwater. That's not how it works. Oh, yeah. Well, it's a blooper. Oh, he wants to fight? If there was a thing that could speak underwater, it'd be a blooper. He doesn't just want to say hi? No. Hey, look, we have an audience member now. Hey. I'm crazy like that. That almost sounds like water bang. Some space saucy mustache guy. But I'm in a world of art. Do you got plans for uh, for um water bane for this one somewhere? Oh, Are you happy like you a, woke up my dog by having me do there's that? There's gotta be a water Hey companion, Mario, right? you remember what Professor Frankly told us, right? You press Y and change that attack order. I know that, Goombella. Can't flee this fight. I am going to have her tattle, because why Is not? there a, an, an aquatic ally you get at some point? Uh, not in this game, actually. Oh. Uh, yeah. Uh, that, yeah, I'm not going to read her tutorials on this. Ew, yeah. slimy, nasty. That's well, a blooper. You know, it's basically a squid. That's only got oh, you know HP. what? It should have been a Splatoon monster. That's what they should have done. Oh. They, they should have, yeah. Can I just say, like, I thought uh, they could no longer make, uh, because that was, like, a big thing. Like, they couldn't uh, actually uh, make, like, custom enemies anymore. Like, they basically were told after this game, knock it off. (laughs) And so that's why, like, Paper Mario is kind of gone to shit, because, like, they they didn't want uh, enemy designs or, like, like look at Goombella, for example. Like, she's she's got a ponytail. Like, you know, I've not gotten her timing down. That's interesting. Cause like now all the the stuff and stuff is generic toads. So they keep so depending upon how good I do with my action commands, they'll fill my star points. Uh. And the more the more of a crowd I have, the more uh, they'll do with. 
Where's also, your stylish? There's this, also, there's a slot machine. I just didn't press it. I should do that, but I don't need to right now. <laughs> uh, slow down. Nice. That's fun. This one. Uh, oh, you just get coins for winning Rich. them. That's fine, but probably we'll break the economy in half. I mean, you know, we'll see how many coins you get. We'll see. We'll see. That's fine. You know, yeah. Killed. Sure did. Hey, look at that. I can proceed forward now. Isn't that nice? Oh, you got a water boat panel? Uh, they're just let me move forward here. Well, there's like a water Unfortunately, boat my, uh, over there at the dock. Yeah, there's an... I, I don't want to... Well, I'll spoil that. There's another curse power that turns you into a boat. <laughs> I That's saw. not a spoiler, really. Oh my god, that Chapter was it. One. Oh my god. Yeah, that was the that was the prologue. Prologue over. Yeah. Castle and dragon. There's a dragon in a castle. It's fine. Who's dragon? Uh who's a dragon. Is it Bowser's dragon? Uh we haven't seen Bowser yet. We don't know what Bowser's up to yet, do we? He's probably being a bitch somewhere. He's probably being a bitch Crying somewhere. Crying into his claws. Fair. Well here we are, at the Petal Meadows where the folks say a crystal star hides. Here we go, Mario, the start of our new adventure. This is completely awesome. I've made an executive decision that Mizuki and AI the Somnium Files 2 will not have a Jersey accent. <laughs> just just, just an executive decision I'm making right there. I mean, that's fine. Because one, it destroys my voice, and two, uh, it's very bad, my Jersey uh, voice. <laughs> <laughs> so. Are you saying that Kadabe Dates wasn't good? I I'm saying yours is significantly better than mine. <laughs> Oh uh, and also, yours doesn't shred my vocal cords. There's a dragon. Yeah, I'm just you know careful about it. Yeah. Gotta say, it's fucking crazy. There's a dragon in a Mario game. I mean, there's a dragon Whoa, in Super Mario World. What was that? Huh? Looks kind of like that guy actually. Super Mario World has dragons. There's a dinosaur. It's got the lava guy that comes out, and he's all like... Blah, 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 blah. Oh, that thing. I guess kind of, yeah. I've never seen I anything that humongous is. before. It looked kind of scary, too. It definitely flew in that castle back there, right? Let's get going in case it comes back. Here we go again. Kill him. Well, hey, now uh, let's uh, bail. And this won't be important later. And probably yeah, that, that won't be important, important later, yeah. No, that looks important. Uh-huh. Yeah, that guy's blinking at you funny, though. Oh, they're just, they're just checking me out. Oh, God. But yeah, no, they... Fuck, dude. The music on this goes hard. It's so good. Like, they didn't have to go this hard with the remake of it. Because the original's great, too. But, like, it's so good. I love it. I mean, it. it feels a lot like the... I guess Mario 8 Deluxe music. Of just kind of, like, full instruments. Like, fully... In, uh, yeah. Whatever you call it. Well, it was like Mario Odyssey had that, too, to be certain. Yeah, but I never played that game. You didn't play Mario Odyssey? No, I probably should. It's good. I was going to start playing it again, but then I started playing uh, something else instead. Uh, I started playing No More Heroes, and uh, uh. now I'm playing uh, Anonymous Code. Oh, uh, I'm playing Xenoblade. You are playing Xenoblade, and you're finally actually... Get, maybe we'll be done by the end of this playthrough. Maybe with <laughs> Xenoblade. Maybe. We'll see. Hopefully I can just dump some time into it. I'm here doing some kind of fetch quest. I could be playing Xenoblade right now. This is I could true. have just brought it with and been playing Well, why here. do you think I want to play Torn of the Golden Country on the channel, like, Rob? Come on. Because you're a nerd? I mean, because I'm a nerd, and also because, like, you know, I feel like... Wait, when is the time to play that? Right after the first game? Yeah. Okay. I mean, is it the proper time to play? I don't know. You know who the main villain is of Xenoblade 2 within the first 30 minutes? If you're called, that's a spoiler that they're also in the prequel. Too. Oh my god, is it Shulk? Oh yeah, my god, it, I would be so happy if it's Shulk. It's not Shulk. Yeah, I know. He comes back in the fucking DLC. Uh, for, for three. Xenoblade 3. Yeah. Well, because he's Damn, like, you got a full fucking... I was going to say, they all came to see the cool stuff here, yeah. Uh, I'm just going to do FP. I'm going to get well. by for as long as I can without doing HP. I've done just a 10 get... HP run before. Oh, ho. Yeah. The only problem is the final boss. Like, if you don't frame perfect, they have attacks that deal 10 damage. Ooh. So I'm not going to do that the full playthrough, but at least I'll do it until we get to that point, probably. Uh, uh, you thought you were kind of... <laughs> yeah, I need, the, I need uh, the new partner for that one. Like a partner with a shell? Yeah, like a partner with a shell. Almost like the first game. Yeah. So, what all were right. you saying about Xenoblade? Uh, well, so Cloak is in Xenoblade 2 because he's a DLC character. Um, so, so he's is Cosmos. Well, uh, she's in base game. DLC. She's in base yeah, game. Telos is uh, in oh, uh, DLC. It, yeah. yeah. 
Um, that's yeah, so Shulk like can all act. I know about the game. That's, Shulk, that's why will, I mentioned it. Shulk will be a blade companion for you, so you get to use the Monado. It's um, it's fine. It's, I don't want to use the Monado. You don't have to. That's the thing. You don't have to do that. Oh, one more thing, Mario. If you ever find yourself wondering what to do, just Never press. Do. You told me this already. I know what to do. Huh? Huh? Uh, goodness. Oh, hey, Shazam, like that. A thing where I can do a thing. I mean, it's a good tutorial to have there because other people will be like, what the fuck? What the fuck do I do there? But yeah, so like you playing Torn at first, I don't think it's going to ruin your Xenoblade 2 experience. I mean, it's fine. Yeah. Because yeah. like, the, the main villain of Torn of the Golden Country is the main villain of Xenoblade 2. Like, I mean, that's it fine. Does, it doesn't matter any. Oh, it's got to be Alpho. Alvis? Alvis. <laughs> it's not Alvis. Fuck. Well, all the people I want to kill aren't bad guys. I mean, they might be bad guys, but I can't I kill mean, them. I mean, this is true. I just want to kill his smarmy, vague, fucking know-it-all ass. Uh-huh. Well, I mean, he, he's that character archetype, which is is fine. Oh, that's smarmy interesting. I didn't know I could hit the douche. grass and take out coins. That's interesting. Uh, what that's Mario games have they had recently? We've got ah! some Mario Odyssey. Have they done any of the... What's the latest like side-scroller style one? Uh, latest side-scroller was Super Mario Wonder that came out last oh, year. Oh, yeah. How was that? Uh, I know people liked it. It had a lot of like... It had like... It sounded like it had a ton of various mechanics. Yeah. Stuff. So like... I... So basically like every level turns into something really weird and it was very creative and very like whatever. But I found the difficulty was kind of very baby easy. Do you think it was kind of one of those games where they experiment with a ton of shit, try and find what the next like main focus power is going to be? Yes. Well, it's like there, there's a whole bunch of different powers and there's a whole bunch of different things. It was just a very, it was a very good game. I just found myself wanting to play Raymond Legends the entire time <laughs> I was playing it. So your mileage may vary on whether or not you think that's a compliment or not. <laughs> it certainly doesn't feel that way. Yeah, yeah. I uh, mean... You want to voice our Koopa friends? Welcome, travelers. Oh, where are you, you ask? Why, this is Petalburg. What a fancy-sounding Koopa. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, but it's been a long time since we've had visitors here. Yeah, but he wants that dragon a hooktail was spotted flying around this area. Well, it didn't help tourism, put it that way. People just stopped visiting. The real estate market went to shit. We're all stuck here. <laughs> dragon, hooktail? That must have been that huge thing we saw earlier, Mario. That's called Hooktail, huh? Mmm, scary names. <laughs> By the way, Green Boots, have you ever heard of this thing called Crystal Stars? Can I just say giving her a Jersey accent with <laughs> how she talks to everybody is actually kind of great? <laughs> Won this quest for them. It's very important. Hey, Crystal Stars, you say? Nope, can't say that I have. Sorry about that. You may want to speak with the mayor, though. He's real. He's old, though. He's like really, really old. So we now know As what such, he will sound like. He knows <laughs> all kinds of stuff. Koopas of his age are, uh, um, they're like really smart. Cause they're old and stuff. Anyway, the mayor lives in that uh, pink house up ahead. A pink house? Sounds totally hideous. But it should be easy yeah, to you find. Can see it from where Thanks you're for standing. your help. The point of view of you is the only thing easy. that should be pink are Goombas. Like, you, you know, you can just easily see oh, it. Oh, hey, this bro. Top of the morning, tis I, Bubblubbler. I am as happy as I can be. Why? Simply because I'm surrounded by flowers. I I didn't realize they had the, I had those ones in this game. I have to talk to this toad. Hey, what's up? I gotta say, I've been playing a lot of GBA games lately. Fucking nerd. There's this one game that Retro just absolutely rules. Bitch. It's called Fire Emblem. Hipster you bitch. ever hear of it? Man, it rocks my socks. Nope. Can this I just is say an, this the is an American game, it's an English game. The best nope, decision I ever made was at your Japanese culture club in high school trading my copy of Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga for Fire Emblem. Great decision. To who? Well, I don't remember. Damn, that's wild. Yeah. Okay. Damn, that's wild. Yeah. Uh, good thing you did that. I was going to say, because oh, that got me into Fire house. Emblem. Yeah. Mm, what? Well, someone there. Who is it? Who? What do you want from me? An old you green may take man. the television. I don't have a television. They he took really the television. Have a television. I know your no thieves TV. here to rob a defenseless old Koopa. Despicable. I'm so glad I could read into what he was going to do already. Oh, man. Look at that. Yeah. I love how they included Koopas from Mar from Paper Mario 64 in here, just for no reason. Oh. That's fun. 
Go on, do what you will, but as you can plainly see, they've already taken the TV. Oh, I guess I have a little money. Take it, you fiends. <laughs> and my antique cow, too. Just leave the photos of me and the missus. Those Can't those do are. without those memories. What? Not thieves, you say? I don't have drugs, either. Oh, wait, your folks looking for crystal stars. Well, why didn't you pipe up before, you idiot? We're just wasting time here. The crystal stars you say are hunting. Mm, wait, what did I hear about those dang things again? Ah, got it, Hooktail. Hooktail's got what you're looking for. She's this enormous ornery dragon. Eats folks, they say. You know Hooktail, right? I might have heard the name. Maybe. Well, this Hooktail's brutal flyby snackings have all of us on pins and needles. So are you reckless fools? I mean... Are you gallant <laughs> heroes off to rough her up? You got it. <laughs> oh, sounds promising. Why, if you can get rid of our silk tail, we'll shower you with gratitude and rewards. What's that I hear? You'll accept no reward? I did not say that. What an unselfish man. Uh -huh. You're noble. Yep, a good egg. Now, what did you say your name was again? Murphy, hmm, that's a fine name. Yes, a fine name indeed. Well now, Murphy. I appreciate that, Murphy. They are nice eyebrows. <laughs> now listen up. If you're intent to go to Oaktail Castle, find the secret pipe that's located somewhere in Petal Meadows. I know you'll need the sunstone and moonstone to use Is the that pipe. True? Those stones are somewhere in Schwank Fortress, just past the village. Get them first. Well then, Murphy, get going and really wallop that hooktail monster. Nail. Nail. What, is he take? Prepare, what about the TV? Prepare two graves. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello there. My name is Koopy Koo. It's nice to meet you. Oh my gosh, that hat, those overalls, and, and that magnificent mustache. You're Mario, aren't you? You killed my father. Prepare <laughs> to die. I mean, I heard yes. tales of how strong you are. If you hear that means you're going to challenge that monstrous hook tail. Kill Ooh, him. If only Coops were as brave as you. That fucking guy. That fucking guy. That fucking guy. Uh, some stone monsters live in Schwank Forest up ahead or so we fear. The gate's here to keep them out. But the mayor says, okay, I'll let you pass. Careful out there, though. Uh, Who's this? So this is our new party member. Uh... You can voice him. That's fine. Just do whatever. Do you'll, whatever. You'll figure out what he is. He's a Koopa. You figure it out. Do it. Um, uh, excuse me. There you go. Uh, I beg He's your pardon. He's calling me Date for no reason. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what his personality is going to be like. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Beg your pardon. Wait a moment, please. Oh, hey. Yeah. No, he looks like Kaname Date. -esque. He pardoned me for yelling like that. I was uh, panicking. Uh, how to begin. Are all of our characters, are all of our party members just going to have Jersey accents? Because if so, I'm on board for that. Yeah, we're all from Jersey. What you think? He's from Brooklyn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Secret Jersey plumber. The, the pipe leads you to Jersey, yes. <laughs> so that's what we learned. Yeah, that's where the pipe leads you. My name's uh, Coops. I heard you travel into Hooktail's castle. I, uh, I have a favor to ask. Yeah, I think I'm whispering it to you right now. Uh huh. I'm having a real awkward silence. Um, he's kind of an awkward. Oh, uh, uh, just yeah. uh, just forget it. Never mind. Ignore me. Uh, good goodbye later. Uh huh. Never talk to me again. Okay, that was weird. What do you think's going on inside that guy's shell? I don't know why you're asking what's going on under my clothes. Uh huh. That's kind of weird. So yeah, he is whole things. He's shy, so it's very interesting that uh, he sounds like Kaname Date, <laughs> uh, who is maybe the exact opposite of shy yeah, by, yeah. In, by every metric. Yeah, he don't give a shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's great. Though I love it. <laughs> no, but I, I want this game to be our. our we gotta be prepared for AI too. So I want you AI to. I want you to. Too. I want you to to do voices outside your comfort zone too. All right, what's a good fucking Iba voice? Then? I'm gonna do uh, Iba voice. well, you're just gonna do that like a robot. So it's like whatever. I'll have to practice robotin. Uh huh. How do you sound like Bender? Bender. Yeah, do do, uh, do Bender give for me. Some me. Bender lines. Let's see. Okay, bite my shiny metal <laughs> ass. Like that's like the bite. key one. Yeah. Let's see. He's kind of deepish, right? Y yeah. Bite he, my shiny he metal like ass. Waka. Like Waka. From Bob hey, uh, I'm a Waka. You know, I'm a Waka in here. <laughs> I'm a Waka. 
If that's not an outtake from a de uh, from a DiMaggio line, that's a bummer. Uh huh. Let's get some classic Bender quotes. Hot diggity daffodil. All right. Well, I'll do this. Hey, sexy mama. Uh -huh. Let's see. How does the rest of that one go? God, I hate these websites. Okay, fine. I'll build my own town with black cack and hookers. Huh? Like that. Uh. Hey, what you doing here? I will do here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's just teaching me that uh, Koopa Troopers exist. Can't flee this fight. Mario, look at audience. That guy's got a rock. There's no way he isn't going to throw it at you. You'll get he hurt if the audience it. hits you with anything, and not just emotionally. Mario. So I have to watch in the crowd because there are some people that will throw helpful things, and some people will throw rocks. Oh. Nice. Lady, you lousy okay. troublemaker. Interesting. Okay, Mario, now try attack with your hammer. I have to attack with my hammer? That's not optimal. Huh? Oh, there you go, though. I, I knocked the stage over. Oh. Which is a thing you can also do. So how do you... Okay. Sometimes your attacks will cause the backdrop to collapse. It can drop on us, too, so watch out. So it's just... It's flavor. Like, it does very little damage, but it's just, it's flavor. It's nice. And so, how can you tell if they're throwing something helpful or helpful? So you'll see if they're holding something in their hands. Like, they'll hold it up. <laughs> hey, sexy mama, want to kill all humans? Yeah. Let's see, how does he do it? Mm. Hey, there's, I, I can't do it. I, I, I can't. He's got, it's like a, it's like a weird combo of deep and, and like high pitch at the same time. Somewhere in the middle. Neat. Like, uh. I, 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 it's definitely not super deep, but like there's a gravitas to it yeah, that I just yeah 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 like a um yeah like your your voice has that far like more than my sonorous, my my like shrill a... Justin <laughs> Roilandy voice. Hey, oh I'll boy! Have to try with different. Uh, oh shit! Hey. This is the video I need. Oh, uh, John DiMaggio personally reviewing impressions of his voice. Interesting. Why is he playing the Joker in that one? Uh, he was this Joker up there top. Oh, no, no, it's not Did he actually ever play the Joker? That's interesting. Yeah. Um, whichever Joker this one is here. That's a good question. I don't... Oh, that's, uh... That's not Killing Joker. I don't know what one that is. It's I mean, 13 this is, years it, ago. Okay. It's, 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 it's got to be one of the ones where Mark Hamill said no. Yeah, like Mark right. Hamill only wants to do it if Kevin Conroy is doing it. Oh. Which is interesting because he's in fucking multiverses. <laughs> but I guess because they have the archive of Kevin Conroy as Batman. Like, I think that's probably why. I guess. I don't know. I guess people enjoy multiverses. I'll say I that guess. much. Uh, yeah. It's really popular right now. I feel like it's a merchandising thing. Well, it, it's a free-to-play game, so like by virtue of like you can play without spending money on it, but you can spend money on it. So I don't know if that's any good or any not. All I know is I don't play games with microtransactions. That's just a rule of thumb. Yeah, that's a good call. Yeah. Oh what boy! Fuck are these things with balls on their chins? These are clefts. Do you remember clefts? No. They were in Paper Mario 64. They have balls on their chins there, too. They're bald cleft. As opposed to ones with, uh, you know, like afros or something. That's oh, how yeah. I tell people when I... That's how I explain people. You know, when I'm bald, that's how I explain to them that I'm bald. Uh-huh. Like, you're, you're, you're I'm bald, bald Rob. As a yeah, I'm you're, you're, bald Rob as opposed to having an afro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you did have long blonde surfer hair for a while. A little bit. Yeah. Only a couple years before it all fell out. Uh-huh. Oh, I mean, I'm kind of growing mine out, so, I mean, you know. I don't know if I'll have long blonde surfer hair. Certainly we'll not. See. It'd be very interesting if my black hair turned blonde for no reason. Are you just listening to John DiMaggio be Joker? Uh, no, his Joker voice kind of sucked. <laughs> so I, I wouldn't think Bender. he'd do a good Joker. I'm sure he could, but it seemed kind of phoned in. Okay. Maybe there are other episodes of it, or other ones of it somewhere. I was, well, because, like, Mark Hamill wasn't the only one who did Joker. Like, Troy Baker does Joker, too. That one's—he's just doing Mark Hamill though, so like that's yeah. easy enough. 
Wait, what else was Troy Baker doing back? We, were, we had a whole big Troy Baker section, didn't we, in one of our oh, earlier episodes? Uh, like, a, well, we had we had a ago. conversation about him, like you know, being the main protagonist of Bioshock Infinite and uh, Last of Us, and uh, yeah, I, I don't remember what the context was for it, but like, we did, did he get have canceled a, or something? Uh, no, I don't think he did. I don't think so. I forget why he can't. Something about him came up somewhere in the stream. Oh, I think we were just talking about like he's like the the big motion capture guy because he's like in Far Cry. He's like he's kind of everywhere. Yeah. I think I think that was the point we were making with that conversation. But in, in fairness, I don't remember. I don't know. It was a while ago. Whenever it was. Yeah. I don't remember why. I can't wait to play uh, the the Bioshock guy. He's got a new game coming out that looks exactly like Bioshock, but <laughs> it's not Bioshock. Is it also like Art Deco set in like weird alternate? It, it looks like punk. Bioshock Infinite, but in space. <laughs> and it's like, yeah, no, I'm for this. It's called uh, Judas, so I'm sure it'll be. Oh boy, that'll yeah. be fun. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm hyped for it. Uh, because it's been in development hell, but like he, but like so is Bioshock Infinite. So like, I have a yeah. thing suspicion it'll be good. I mean, maybe it won't be. Maybe this is just Devil's Third. <laughs> uh, He's been cut loose to just do his own shit. Well, because like third. he left, he left uh, EA to go make his yeah. his own mm -hmm. game again. So it's like you know. Like, I mean, let's just, re let's just, let's just respect that their own game. this is true. So like, let's just respect the fact that he left fucking EA. <laughs> like, you yeah, know, right. Like, we, we should want everybody to leave EA. <laughs> it's <laughs> unfortunate they haven't. Uh-huh. Well, you got to pay the bills, you know. You, you, you got you to... Uh, just because somebody's making something artless doesn't mean, you know, they should, <laughs> you know, live in poverty. <laughs> yeah, I make artless shit all the time at work. Uh huh. That's our whole fucking. That's our whole deal. Well, because you well, because you work for a corporation that just makes soulless programs. I used to yeah, work exactly. for that too. Yeah. Yeah. I fucking hated it. I was like, that doesn't mean like because I fucking thought making insurance software is boring. That doesn't mean like I should you know. Tarred and feathered. That doesn't yeah. mean I should eat sand. Like you know, it's like there are yeah. other reasons you should eat sand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's very nutritious, Rob. It's full oh, of God, rocks. Yeah. It's good. You can turn it into glass. You can turn it into glass in your stomach. It's great. Uh, hey, you got a pow. I got a pow, yeah. I mean, it's good for just dealing damage to shit when I don't want to deal with stuff, which is often, like against these things, because these things have very high defense. <laughs>